Hello everyone, welcome to this day one of 30 day freelancing challenge for mechanical engineers. Today, I will introduce you about this challenge. Like what are the things we are going to cover? What are the requirements are needed for this challenge? And what are all eligibility criteria? And I will also be giving you a task that you had to perform for day one. Before we we'll move forward, I would like to clarify you that in this challenge, there is going to be five bakes, right? And in five bakes, we are not going to give you challenge for every day. It's a complete 30 day challenge, but you will only be getting uh, tasks for five days each week. So don't get overwhelmed. This is challenge is going to be completely simple. And if you will follow all my steps that I am providing into this challenge, then you will start earning. You will start working as a freelancer. And one more thing to start this challenge, to work as a freelancer, to be a freelancer, you don't need to leave your full time job. Just keep your full time job and start working as a side hustle as a freelancer. Take this profession as a side hustle. And freelancing is also a new profession. You cannot take it very casually. You have to take it a little bit seriously. If you really want to start earning some amount of money, if you want to get a financial freedom, if you want to get a time freedom, then you have to take this profession seriously. And it's not like regular job. For example, if you are working as a XY job on an XY salary, then definitely if you will switch the job, you will get a high right? But in case of freelancing, there is no such case. If even if you have 20 plus year of experience, 30 plus years of experience, and if you will start freelancing from today, you had to start from scratch. You, to, you had to start from zero. So there is no way you can start freelancing today and you will be getting a big project from today itself it's not possible it's almost impossible so as you can see we are into the day one of our week one challenge and today i will just be giving you the introduction and in this introduction we'll be covering topics like what are the expectations and what are all the eligibility for this complete 30 day challenge and then the challenge requirements so first the introduction we had already talked about like people are almost 450 people had joined for this challenge from different states different countries right the people are coming from globally into this challenge and they want to be a freelancer mostly mechanical engineers now let's move on to the realistic expectations before we'll start the challenge i want to be very clear that even if you complete this challenge there is very less chances that you will be worth earning in lakhs or crores right if you are thinking that if you'll start working as a freelancer you will make lakhs of rupees crores of rupees it's almost impossible i don't know who has created this misconception that a freelancer can earn 10 lakh 20 lakh rupees per month it's not possible as a freelancer if you are working as an individual person it's not possible to crack that much amount of money very few people less than one percent people who are into freelance industry has maybe cracking such amount of money but they are putting lots of lots of work into that thing so it's almost impossible the realistic expectation you have to keep up with the realistic expectations and that expect expectations is that the first milestone that we're going to set is 500 rupees 500 inr if you're from india that is a very less amount that will be our first milestone as a freelancer so if you'll complete all the 30 day tasks all the tasks i'm giving into this complete challenge then i can help you to get that milestone of 5000 rupees so that is what i can do i can help you get started if you'll follow me, if you'll keep doing all the things I'm sharing, if you will learn all the tools I'm sharing, and if you'll take it seriously. That is what I can promise. And I told you, don't keep the unrealistic expectation. Just keep your foot on down to the earth and definitely you're going to succeed. The next thing is eligibility. So for this challenge, there is one single eligibility is that you have to be mechanical engineers because this complete challenge that I had designed is completely based on mechanical engineering domain. So all the tools, techniques, process that I'm going to discuss during this challenge is, will be based mostly related to mechanical engineering. So if you are not a mechanical engineer, if you are a CAD designer or some other designer, this challenge can definitely help you but my contents will be mostly focused towards mechanical engineering. So uh, this is the eligibility of this complete challenge. So if you're from different domain, it's completely your choice. If you want to be into this challenge, you are welcome. Even if you don't want to be into this challenge, I, I completely thankful for you that at least you had came for this first day uh, task. Now, the next thing is the challenge requirements. So I don't need much from you. The only requirement for this challenge is I need your time. You had to dedicate your time, whatever the task I'm giving, you had to perform it seriously. If you'll do it seriously, 
in the later days in the later step of our challenge you will find that the steps that i had said it makes sense the, there is a reason behind everything that i'm asking you to do so please do whatever i'm trying to ask you to do please do it and don't just do blindly take take your own research think about your own i'm not going to say you that i uh, just write a blank check in, in in the name of myself i'm not going to ask you for that i will be simply asking you to do things that is going to help you in the long run in freelancing industry so just give your time to me next thing is dedication if you are coming into this challenge definitely you have to dedicate some time every one of you like you or me who are working as a full time uh, job somewhere we have some hours left where i can dedicate where we can dedicate some time to this freelancing profession so try to learn try to improve skills during that time and dedicate some time to this challenge otherwise there is no way you will be able to succeeding into this program freelancing is just another kind of business i told you where you had to be your marketer you had to be your lead generator you have to be your uh, execute your projects you have to manage your financial you have to closing your clients so everything every responsibility you, you need to take so you cannot be a irresponsible person if you want to be a freelancer you have to be very responsible to say yes or no for example if you are accepting any project you had to say yes or no whether you will be able to perform that project or not don't just take the project stop taking calls stop responding to emails stop re responding stop responding to whatsapp messages be be a serious person be a responsible person take the responsibility so this was all about the today's agenda and uh, the day one agenda and as you can see the task for the today the day one is to why do you want to be a freelancer answer this question why do you want to be a freelancer post it onto your social media right post it because i just want to know why every one of you all the mechanical engineers who had joined into this challenge why do you want to be a freelancer and also attach these hashtags the first two, two hashtags is for the domain as you can see the first hashtag is for mechanical engineer the second is hashtag is for freelance and the third hashtag is just to make sure that i will be able to find your post into the community whether you had posted or not because why i am giving this task i will be explaining you in the later coming days but this task also makes sense there is a reason behind it i am asking you to do so please write it down please post it onto your social media whatever platforms you are using whether it's facebook linkedin instagram whatever platform you are using answer this question why do you want to be a freelancer this this is just going to take few minutes of time from you and this is the day one task it is very simple just do it and thank you so much again for coming into this 30 day freelancing challenge i really am really happy that i am being connected with this many of mechanical engineers and sharing my knowledge with all of you for free since this is a first batch lots of things maybe i will be organizing in the coming days but thank you so much guys for supporting me and joining this challenge listening to me and see you in the day 2 challenge thank you so much just finish the task that i had given to you see you in the day 2 thank you